So what we did was we updated the phase one data on Zander Brutini, which had a number of histologies, but there were a fair number of patients with mantle cell lymphoma. Um, and we updated the follow-up on these patients. And essentially what we're seeing is a high uh, overall and, com um, and complete remission rates, probably similar to that of um, acalabrutinib and a progression-free survival that is about 15 to 16 months. So overall, uh, what we see is good tolerance of the drug. We think that we're seeing response rates and progression-free survivals, which are encouraging. Um, now, I wouldn't say that the, the results are superior to that of ibrutinib or acalabrutinib, I would say that the efficacy results are probably similar, but the tolerance is very good.